view. Look, I'm a baron. Oh, Jean, I can. your head. Main Fräulein. Time is beckoning. 
settled down. Swirl, mark two. As you wish, main Fräulein. Reward on the road.
You've arrived. Come closer. Can you smell that? Something must have happened in the temple. I imagine there will be slimes, hilly churls, and whatever's giving Storm Terror extra power. Oh, yes. 
It is going to be lively in there indeed. Oh, oh, you're quite the brave one, aren't you? It's a pity that the Temple of the Wolf has been disturbed by such an atrocity. Let's head in. No one makes offerings to the Four Winds anymore. Yet the old winds never vanish. We need to clear out the temples. For the Four Winds. Let me show you how the Knights of Favonius conquer our adversaries. Hmm. If I'm not mistaken, the end of the temple should be up there. Wait, how do you know? <laughs> Ex Experience. The kind of experience you get after years of dealing with things like this for others. Let it rain! Windblade! Traveler, unless I'm mistaken, you don't seem to have a vision. So how exactly is it that you're able to channel elemental energy? Seems the path ends here. Let's use the wind currents to fly up. Observation. We should get June to give you a title and make you a knight. What's the hurry?
freeze! Speaking of, did you know? Storm Terror was once one of the Four Winds. I'm not aware of the exact details. If you're interested, you can ask the Acting Grand Master about it. using to gain its power? Seems probable. Let's deal with it. Bravo! What a performance. You are, to my surprise, a well-trained knight. The battles you just fought were sights to behold. <laughs> I see you already have the knightly virtue of modesty. Stories of your heroic deeds to save Mondstadt from destruction shall be known throughout the City of Freedom, well into the future. Please do visit me at our headquarters when you have the time. I also know a lovely tavern, if that's more your thing. Quite rewarding, no? We've seized another temple from Storm Terror's grasp! I can take care of the rest here. You go take care of other things while I'm at it. There's no way hilly turtles organize an ambush like this themselves. Not with their limited mental capacity. <laughs> Thus you were behind this. Knights of Avonius, always so inefficient. Agree to disagree, but your involvement in this just made things a whole lot more interesting. Kaya, Knight of Favonius, please allow me to join you on your journey. Guarding you on your journey sounds far more entertaining than any of the usual Favonius stuff. Thank you. 
from this world?
Hey, cutie. You're going to help me out, too? How kind of you. Don't hesitate to come to me if you need anything. Good question. Basically, things other than that which require brawn or brain. So, what does that leave? I guess I could give this a go. I knew it! There is a strong elemental energy coming from deep within this temple. Paimon, are you able to float across? Can't do much even if she does. Good point. We'd better start looking for a way to get up there then. Let's ride this wind current, shall we? Leave it to me. It's an Electro Monument. No wonder. Let me try to activate it with a... ...bit of Electro Power. Stand back, sweeties. You're in for a little shock. Hit! Wet enemies, I've got them covered. Oh, another wind current. Let's ride it up from here. No, 
what escapes my sight? Chain lightning can be set off between electrocharged opponents. The electrical discharge caused by friction is only a little less shocking than love at first sight. about this gem? You're kidding. You're seriously asking? This is a vision. It's used by the Chosen to draw on elemental powers. In terms of mysticism, I suppose you could call it a magical lightning rod. Vision? Just where exactly are you from? Are you a hilly churl with some level of reasonable intelligence? No, I doubt it. After all, hilly churls aren't exactly known for their smarts. And you, you more or less qualify to be a magister's apprentice. Break it, and we can head home and relax. Oh, it's one of those consolidated wind things. Let's head back to the statue of this. Dragon of the East, Lion of the South, Wolf of the North, Falcon of the West. They are the four winds of Mondstadt, affiliated with Barbados, the god of Animo. The Dragon of the East, Storm Terror, its real name is Devalin. Though most in Mondstadt seem to have forgotten that in all this Storm Terror business. So now you know why Devalin is only able to channel three of the four winds' power because it has been consuming itself from the beginning. Because of hatred, I presume. Hatred? Hatred for Mondstadt. Hatred drove it to become something more powerful than the wind itself, to become Storm Terror. But why would one of the four winds hate the city it was supposed to protect? Uh... As a child of Mondstadt, it's something that's really hard to say aloud. Here, take this. It's a very old story from more than a century ago. Well, you should come with me. Paimon will tell you about the rest later. darling. I'll take very good care of you. So... Oh, it's finally done! Well, all that lay flow and elemental line stuff Lisa was going on about should hopefully be back to normal. Wanna go back and see how the knights are doing? But if you got anything more interesting to do, Paimon can come too. By the way, we obtained another Animunculus in one of the Four Winds temples, right? We might come across more of them in the future, so don't forget to offer them to the statues.
over there waving to you. Let's go and see what she wants. Welcome to the Adventurers Guild. Actually, I have had my eye on you for a long time. You've had your eye on him, eh? Has she been causing some mischief? Oh, that is not what I meant at all. Being on the lookout for great adventurers is part of my job. When I look at you, I see one with the potential to rival the great adventurers of Legends. Paimon sees it too. Paimon always feels safe adventuring with him. Nevertheless, to the adventurer, experience is far more precious than potential. You must accumulate adventurer experience to increase your adventure rank. Time is of the essence. Allow me to brief you on... Wait, are you saying we're like official adventurers now? Do not worry. The Adventurers Guild does not charge a membership fee or impose any kind of duties on its members. In short, there are lots of benefits but no drawbacks to becoming a member. Basically, the Adventurers Guild rewards you every time your adventure rank increases. Here is a new member's gift for you. You will need to return here to claim rewards in the... <laughs> Without further ado, please allow me to officially welcome you, our new avid adventurer, into the guild. Here is your adventurer handbook. A new member coming aboard is a momentous occasion. A little ceremony is only fair. It has a record of available commissions and rewards. And it is also proof of your membership. Oh, and one more thing. Sometimes you will find yourself stuck at a certain adventure rank. When this happens, you need to perform some impressive feats to gain further recognition from the guild. Impressive feats? Sounds like hazing to me. They are simply specific adventures that allow you to ascend to the next adventure rank on completion. Ascension adventures, if you will. But that will come later. Opportunities to win recognition will come as you gain more adventure experience. That will do for today. We will have plenty of chances to meet again in the future. Ad Astra Abyssosk Adventurer. With effort, you shall reach the stars and conquer the abyss. We must order ourselves a generous serving of fisherman's toast from Good Hunter, pronto! It's on you, of course. It's so delicious! Hum, hum, hum. Good Hunter's fisherman's toast is the best! This might surprise you, but it's actually a classic Mondstadt recipe that anyone can cook. You can try cooking it yourself if you have the ingredients. Can your cooking skills surpass that of Good Hunters? Why, Paima would love to be your personal taster. Don't you let me down!
This is bad. Such a ha- Oh, thank the thousand winds. Your arrival must be the grace of the gods. If I may ask, envoy sent by the Animo God to save this mere mortal, could you spare a moment? Ew, cut it out. Marvelous. I cannot let my peers hear about this. I cannot seek help from anyone else but you. Please, let us move to somewhere more fit for such conversations. Let's talk in the courtyard just outside headquarters. Come with me. What's with the sneakiness? This place will do. Tell us what it's about already! How should I begin? Oh, right. Let me tell you a secret first. It's a secret of my past, and I confide in you to keep it. Don't worry, Paimon's lips are sealed. As a matter of fact, my grandfather was a pirate. Oh. Wait, why do you sound so blithe? Do you think I'm making it up? Look at my eye patch. I inherited it from my grandfather, and this is solid proof that we are related by blood. Yesterday, I was glancing through the notes my grandfather left and stumbled upon records that spoke of a treasure. Treasure? According to his notes, the treasure is buried in the lost Arcadian ruins. Treasure. But the location of the ruins is currently unknown. I've tried searching for clues. Or better yet, gems? <laughs> treasures that consist of nothing but gold and gems are third-rate treasures. My grandfather's treasure is a sword. A magic sword that grants the wielder unrivaled power. Oh, wow! The sword was dropped from Celestia into the sea by a god. It was later salvaged by my grandfather's crew by pure coincidence. The moment he gripped the sword, thunder roared, billows howled, and the clear skies were suddenly swallowed by raging winds. With the might of the magic sword, my grandfather went on to defeat a hydra, a silver-haired banshee, a wicked abyss dragon. But the immense power of the sword enticed many more greedy pirates. To avoid meaningless conflicts, my grandfather hid the magic sword. The world we live in is fascinating. Full of unknown and inexplicable wonders. Holy moly, that's just insane! A gang of treasure hoarders has been very active lately, and many ruins have had their relics stolen by them. I'm afraid that they will soon discover the Arcadian ruins, and the magic sword will be lost. We won't let it fall into the wrong hands! We must get the sword before them! You just rest assured that we are here to help! Wow. Great. Please keep it a secret. I'll wait for your good news. Hey, so what you think? Isn't it exciting? We're talking about a super duper powerful sword! Well, let's go to the Adventurers Guild and see if we can find out more. The adventurers should know more about the ruins, right? <laughs>
The ties beckon. Enhanced animal module 75. <laughs> Wings of darkness. Come, sever night from day. Hey, hey, go away. for the wicked. Kiddo, welcome to the Adventurer's Guild. Hmm. We're not here for something that boring. We're looking for a sword that fell from Celestia. One that can kill eight-headed banshees and silver-haired hydras. It's super mega uber powerful. That's what Paimon said. It's a super epic sword. Anyway, it's fine as long as Paimon doesn't tell them the treasure's location. So, Sai 
Cyrus, do you know where the lost Arcadian ruins are supposed to be? Arcadian ruins? Never heard of them. Thanks for your intel anyway. If you do find these ruins, I'd love to see them. Uh, my intel? Still no clues. Well, it's not like it's gonna be easy. Come on, it's the hiding place of the super amazing sword. Anyway, we should go meet up with Gaia first. Oh, you're back. Do you have news for me? Listen, we asked around the Adventures Guild and found... Well... Nothing. <laughs> that much is expected. Why is that? Oh, I only mean that... What's the fun in finding it without the hard work? However, I do have some clues. I sent someone to collate Black Market Intel. It seems that someone does know about the Arcadian ruins. Really? Where's the guy? Now, now, as per the Black Market's rules, they will send someone to meet us to prevent leaks. We will be meeting the informant at the Whispering Woods. Then what are we waiting here for? That's right. You read my mind. I am a knight, so I shouldn't have any dealings with the Black Market. You have my thanks. Of course, you'll be compensated for your troubles. By the knights. Ooh! No problemo! Welcomes you.
a little close. <clears throat> Don't be such a brute. <sighs> Disappear! Why is this happening to me? I shouldn't have helped him. Him who? Thanks so much for saving me. You're far more reliable than those Favonius guys. It's nothing. He's a traveler. He has to deal with stuff like this all the time. Traveler? I've heard stories about you. I didn't think I'd be saved by the one I'm here to meet. Oh, so you're the... <laughs> I didn't know how I could pay you back initially, but now I think I'll just give you the intel for free. People in our circle know how important the network is. Lucky? But it's lucky for Kaya, isn't it? He's supposed to pay for the intel. Listen well then. The intel on the Arcadian ruins. Three six-armed giants reside in the city in the lake. Two guard the statue, one the treasure. Wait, is that it? There's also this map that came with it. Could this be the X marks the spot? So the clue is more like a riddle. Well, should be a piece of cake for you, right? Hi. Well, if you can't solve it, we can ask Kaya. He seems like a nerd too. I'll leave you the intel so you can review it at any time. Thanks, Vile. Three six-armed giants reside in the city in the lake. Two guard the statue, one the treasure. What does that mean? If you don't want to ask Kaya, you better figure it out. Let it know. I'll race you there. Bet you can't. <sighs> Get ready. I won't. Opening a chest is like another. Wow. Uh, out. Uh, take cover. Hey. Die. Must. You. Uh, uh, not so hard. Uh, we had the Outrider Amber. <laughs> Mm. 
unleashed Pima. Come on, what? Do you think that we're. What? 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 Propaganda! Ha! Go! Water! Ha! Disappear! Go with the wind! Ha! Quit! To dust! Ha! Thunder! Bellowing! Sa! German! Spring forth! Yeah! Wipe out bombs! Is the- uh, I'll keep this close. Let me- Look out! This- Just- This world is f- There's still- This is not- The end. You're back. Looks like you got the intel. Yes and no. It's a lot more complicated than that. Three six-armed giants reside in the city in the lake. Two guard the statue, one the treasure. What do you make of it? Riddles. How quaint. <laughs> Let me think. The city in the lake is clearly Mondstadt. As for the six-armed giants... Hmm... Hey! That's smart! A windmill has six blades. 
It fits. Wow, that makes sense! So out of the three windmills, two are close to the statue. But the other one is guarding. Ooh, ooh, this one Paimon knows, the treasure! <laughs> let's hope it's really that simple. Come on, let's go take a look around that windmill! from this world? The passion rushing through the clear spring is just a front. When she's cold and alone, her true heart is revealed. There's another map! More riddles? Paimon's dizzy already! Or Paimon will let you have all the fun! Or you could get Kaya to help! Hmm. 
She doesn't love him at all. The passion rushing through the clear spring is just a front. When she's cold and alone, her true heart is revealed. Any idea what that means? Is this some page stripped from a love novel that you just happened to find? Oh, so it's not a clue. No wonder someone as clever as Paimon wasn't able to get it. <laughs> I'm just joking. Seriously, Kaya. <laughs> this riddle is hard to figure out. Clear spring. Is it referring to Springvale? Passion rushing through the clear spring. So when does passion rush through a clear spring? Not a bad idea. Like when uh, there's a waterfall, for example. It appears the solution to this enigma relates to the waterfall behind Springvale. Only the clear spring that blesses Mondstadt can reveal the passion described here. And the heart of the waterfall must refer to the cliff on the left side of the waterfall. I noticed it once when I was out on patrol in the area. The ending, cold and alone, probably has something to do with cryo, which can be controlled by a vision. You should probably take someone who can manipulate cryo with you. It's nothing. If a knight of Favonius couldn't even answer a riddle, how could we be trusted to solve criminal mysteries? Let's go take a look in Springvale. We'll leave you to your criminal mysteries. Um... Uh, no, wait! Um, leave you to solving your criminal mysteries. Bye. 
Watch this! What's the hurry? Oh, I'm so sorry. What's the hurry? <laughs> Come a little closer.
Is this an answer from this world? Frostbite. Dodge this. Cool it. Surrender and I'll be gentle. this close. It looks like it was drawn by a pirate. So, now... Hmm... Paimon believes that there is no need! Let's go for it! Don't want anyone else to get there before we do. Like... Like the treasure hoarders Gaia told us about. Anyways, Paimon just wants to borrow the sword to... No, you are nothing. Paimon, uh, Paimon just wants to see it. <laughs> Definitely not to become super mega powerful and do nothing but play. <laughs> All right, Paimon will save the chit chat for later. Arcadian treasure hunt, here we go! Seems all the other knights already have their hands full. Cool it! This moment will be frozen in time. Ah!
Closer. Hey, get him! Cool it! Oh, so sorry. Thank <laughs> you. 
the wind. Cool it. Ha. Ha. This moment. 
Hulk will be frozen in time. Enjoy this too much. <laughs> Wind blade! 